your channel. In today's video, we are going to continue with the Halloween content. I hope you're enjoying it. I hope you're getting some kind of ideas um, just to make the um, this next month more fun. Uh, in the last few neighborhoods that we've lived in, well, all of the neighborhoods we've lived in, we always do the tradition of booing our neighbor. Um, Hopefully you know what that means. If you don't, let me explain it really fast. You don't have to do this. These gift ideas can be used for your kids, your kids as teachers, your coworkers, your friend, anybody really. They're just cute gifts that I've put together that I think are great for Halloween. Um, anyway, I pick up these little stationery sets from Target. I love them because if I don't, then you have to print these out on the internet. I will link a bunch that I think are cute in the description box if you want to check them out and you don't want to buy one. But I buy um, this little set and it comes with the card that you need to give um, so that it this tells whoever you're booing what they need to do. And so pretty much um, what you do is you ding dong ditch your neighbor and leave them a fun gift and then they go ding dong, ding dong ditch somebody else in the neighborhood with a cute little gift. So it comes with the directions on what they're supposed to do with this little envelope and then this um, little boot like a little sign you hang on your door so that everybody knows that you've been booed so not to boo you um, it has two sides they're so cute and for five bucks you get two sets so that's the idea you're supposed to boo two different neighbors um, and then they can just make a copy of this or make their own or whatever anyway I made a really cute one last year. I'll put it up on the screen here. And it was a big hit, and so I thought I would do it on YouTube this year. Um, I'm gonna make something similar to the one I did last year. However, I can't find all the cute things that I did last year. So, it'll, it's still cute. And this one is actually bigger, so you could fit more treats in it. Um, but anyway, let's just get going. I have three different ideas. Um, and I hope you enjoy them. Leave me in the comments which one's your favorite. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. I would appreciate it. And let's get going. Okay, so for the first gift idea, I have a cute little um, carameled apple basket. In the bottom, I just put some of this crinkly paper in and filled it with apples so i have four apples in here um, you could put as many as the family you know the number amount the amount of people in the family that you're giving it to um you just depends on what size of basket you need walmart carries three different sizes and this is the smallest size and it was 4.97 and then you could either make your own caramel or buy it i bought it and i just filled this cute little jar um, from pioneer woman with the caramel and just tucked it in there really cute like that and then I just added the directions for how the next person is to boo somebody and then the little sign for their door so people know that they've already gotten a cute little surprise so this is the number one and I just tied a cute little gingham bow on the front and if you want to get really fancy you could put some so like cellophane wrap around it but I'm not fancy and I'm just going to set it on somebody's door like this okay this next one that I have is just it's just full of treats there's nothing really special about it except for the tin which I think is so cute for Halloween um, I got it at Michael's and it was half off so it was only four dollars and then I just picked up some treats from the dollar store and stuck in there um, I filled it up to the eyes with um, the crinkly paper and then just stuck these little cute pumpkin picks in there. Um, last year at the dollar store they had some really cute witch feet that I stuck out the top you saw um, in the beginning of the video. But they don't have those this year so this is what we're working with. But I still think it's absolutely adorable. I love, love these tins this year. I loved them last year too. But. Anyway, there is number two. Okay, and the last one, I just have like a baking one. I picked up the cute little Pillsbury um, Funfetti Halloween cake, and I got some frosting, some cupcake liners, and then an extra thing of sprinkles. So 
and then just with the um, door hanger again this one is really cute and then I put it in a little witch um, cauldron the little trick-or-treat basket things and it is adorable and it's so inexpensive because this was a dollar and then everything else in here was a dollar fifty so if you wanted to go cheaper this was a good one actually honestly they're all very cheap all of them are under ten dollars way under ten dollars so anyway i hope you guys like it let me know what your favorite one in the description is below and i will catch you guys next time